what is good everybody at YouTube we got an online gameplay here I know it's been a long time since I posted one of the one of these games um, using the, the 49ers in this matchup against the Tennessee Titans a great game now I don't really I know I don't really post a lot of games um, online gameplay like I used to I'm trying to do more um, draft champions and also a lot of mud team um, the reason why I play mud team now is because the fact that this year's mud I really like this year's mud and the solo challenges are pretty pretty nice as well I just finished a one of the the solo challenges about a month ago I'm trying to finish another one um, the one I'm aiming for is the under 50 uh, challenge that one is kind of hard to do in the sense that um, the solo challenge only comes on a certain time during the week and that is on Sundays and um, you only get it you only have about eight hours to complete that challenge other than that that's it after that that's it you don't get you know any more chances um, the reason why that solo challenge is very important for me to complete is the fact that once you complete it you get a 99 overall Steve Young 99 that's right 99 overall now it's only about 50 of them so it's like pretty much 50 Super Bowl that you have to play and win and when you win you get the of course on the 50 you get one of the Super Bowl badges that you um you can add to on the 50 set so I really really do want to get that uh Steve Young if I can get him that's a wrap I don't know if I'll sell him because I know if I if I sell him I'm putting them for at least maybe two three maybe two to three uh, million coins because I remember when um, Odell Beckham the 99 overall Odell Beckham jr. Uh, card first I guess first uh, was released in the mutt master and that card was going for about three million coins three million coins and that was the only card on the on the auction block so I really do want that Steve, Steve Young uh, um, card yeah look at this wide open pass and he just straight missed it oh my goodness I don't know if I overthrew it and then we try to play again and this time we end up going for six um, up by 14 up by seven points there so um, yeah uh, back to the gameplay now the 49ers I'm kind of uh, a little bit disappointed in the 49ers the 49ers they're not doing so good right now. Their record as of today is two and five. Their next game is with the Rams, my other team. And you we both know who's gonna win that game. Of course the Rams the Rams are um, their defense is straight ridiculous. Todd Gurley is straight body slamming everybody. That guy is unstoppable. I knew that guy was going to be a beast ever since preseason. That guy is amazing, man. I really like Todd Gurley. Um, in that division, Arizona Cardinals leads that division again as of today with a 5-2 and two record. Then uh, it's followed by the Rams with a 3-3 three and three record. And then the Seattle Seahawks and 49ers are in last place. Now, as far as the divisional game is concerned, um, Arizona and the Seahawks both have a one and one record in that division. The Seahawks, uh, not Seahawks, sorry, the 49ers are 0 and 2, while the Rams are 2 and 0. So, in my opinion, I really think the Rams could take that division lead. They're only about with two or two and a half games behind the Arizona Cards for first place, and also if they can even get at least half game behind or one game behind the Cardinals I really think they can make the playoffs um, because so far so good um, in the NFC East East uh, that division is a little bit jumping we have they have like two teams uh, with three and four record the New York Giants are four and three so um, I don't know what's gonna happen in that division the next division NFC South now NFC South is kind of tough because Carolina Panthers Atlanta Falcons both have a good record and then NFC North Green Bay Packers of course whom I think they're gonna lose to the Broncos uh, 6 and 0 Minnesota Vikings 4 and 2 now Minnesota Vikings is one surprising team 
Um, so I really think the the Rams can make the playoff this year because uh, the teams that made the playoff last year they're not doing so good. So we could sleep, we could slip in uh, the wild card, or we could get that divisional champion. Uh, we could be a divisional uh, champion. So back to the gameplay. 17-7. The guy just scored on that last drive. That was supposed to be an interception. As we try to run the ball going through the fourth quarter here, 13-13, I don't know what happened. I tried to throw it deep to Quentin Patton, and yeah, that wasn't successful. So we end up putting the ball uh, with only five minutes and a couple of change left. Now, my intention is for this guy not to score a touchdown, even a field goal, because, you know, this guy, man, this guy is pretty, I'm not going to lie, this guy was pretty good. Um, I think he ended up throwing a pick, not on this drive, or maybe on the next two drive, he throws an interception. He just threw it straight to uh, the safety. There as he get a screen pass, and we stopped it. And then third and ten. Let's see what he does here. Oh, yeah, he gets a first down here, slant pass to uh, the receiver. And then first and ten, let's see what happens. Um, I, like I said, man, I'm trying not to let this guy score as he gets a big, huge run. Almost got the first down there, and then here, um, almost got the first down as well. Run the ball, and then play action. Look at this interception. <laughs> he overthrew that ball, and he just threw it straight to the safety as we get a second pick, our second or third pick of the game. I'm not, I'm not quite sure. I think that was a second pick, and then pretty much that was it, man. Right now, I'm not gonna let this guy get the ball. Well, I was wrong because there I end up. I don't know why I threw the ball. I should have just ran it, even though he has no more timeouts left. Four and thirteen, two minutes and fifty seconds left. Let's see if this guy could run the two minutes. Uh, two minutes no huddle offense on me, as he's he's pretty much doing no huddles on all these plays, all these first down because you know I'm trying not to let him go out of bounds at all. Try to get some clock out, and we bake that. Look at that. That was a nice interception. Beautiful. He, man, that's pretty much it. That sealed the game right there as we get a big touchdown here. Wide open. Quentin Patton. Oh, sorry. That's not Quentin Patton. That's uh, Smith. As we almost... Look at that. I played too much, man. That could have been a fumble, and I could have lost that game if he had stripped me. As we get a big, huge touchdown there from Smith, and now we are up by 10 points, 24-14. Uh, it's pretty much over, man. Over with. This guy's not going to score a touchdown. There's no way I'm going to let him score a touchdown. And I think he ended up throwing another interception right here. And that was the third or fourth interception of the game. And uh, that's pretty much it, man. Thank you guys for watching. If you haven't, please subscribe for more Madden videos. Smash that like and subscribe button. And I will see you later. Peace.